Hey there, been a while since we've been in this white void, huh? Guess what I've been asked to show you today? Something friggin' awesome. If you haven't heard of this browser, download it now. It's called Opera GX, and they've reached out to me to help bring the magic of this wonderful browser to your mobile devices and computers. So why is Opera GX better than any other browser? Well, my favorite thing, when I type, it makes audible clicks in the browser, which for my ADD brain is literally just pure euphoria. Not only that, it reopens all of my tabs when I close it and reopen it. I can limit the amount of RAM the browser itself uses, unlike Google Chrome, and much, much more. What's part of that much more? Discord, Messenger, Twitch, and Twitter integration all built into the sidebar. A single click and you can check Discord DMs, tweets, or which of your favorite streamers are live. Not only that, it's highly customizable with backgrounds and color choices. Last but not least, you can transfer all of your browser data from your previous browser of choice. Be sure to go ahead and get Opera GX Mobile afterwards, because pairing them together you're able to sync up all your stuff across both platforms and it's just really, really helpful. So be sure to check my link down in the description below and download Opera GX today. Honestly, you will not regret this change. This browser is amazing, and I've been using it ever since they reached out to me. Happy for you- What? What? You need to know what you did. I do. Stop looking at me like you're my mom walking in on me and AJ in the barn. Alright, that's all I want to hear about that. Hello everybody, happy for you- What are you jackasses doing? God damn it. Where were the two of you? Lubot got me ice cream. That seems uncharacteristically kind of you, Lubot. Give it a minute. Uh... <laughs> Anyways... Happy for you. Hey guys, I got a new movie. Come on. It's about a toddler who gets hit by a bus, and we watch their family cry for 40 minutes. Eh, uh, and? That's it. If I wanted to see a child get hit by a bus, I'd just push Phoebe in front of one. You wouldn't do that, right? Of course I would. Shut up! God! Ugh. <sighs> okay. Happy four years, everybody! September 5th marked the four-year anniversary mark of the first video ever being uploaded onto this channel, which was way back in 2017. Way back when I still used Fluttershy as my stills. That's... that's identity theft and cultural appropriation. No, it would be cultural appropriation if I made mustard gas, Spritzy. But you're German. Oh, right. Over the last four years, we've seen a lot of changes take hold on this channel. If you scroll back through my catalog, you won't find a single year that looks similar to another. Different stills, styles, and videos were experimented with over that length of time, leading us to where we are now. For the foreseeable future, I think it's safe to say that The Butter Show is a permanent mainstay on the channel. In fact, I have plans to continue to grow the show far into the future. The main thing we're focused on right now, though, is continuing ahead with our planned lineup we have set from now till the end of December. The next character coming is another pony. Since Lubot and Phoebe balance one another out, I thought it'd be good to have another pony to balance out Spritzy. Meet Sydney Spindlechalk. This may just be a prototype design, but nonetheless, it's very cute. Designed by a lovely artist of ours, Sam is Sleeping, this design has only a few things that are set in stone, which you can expect to see appear on the show. First of all, she's blind. Secondly, she's more of a dark, quiet, emo kind of girl, so the polar opposite to Spritzy's deranged and extroverted brain-damaging antics. The hell do you mean, brain-damaging? We haven't really got a timetable for when Sydney will appear, so be sure to follow my Twitter to get the latest notifications on that. I usually post about upcoming things on there. Also, be sure to check out the community tab if you're looking for updates specifically. Next up, I'd like to announce a special design being sold on multiple products for a limited time only. This design was actually in the Coraline episode. It's the doll! Half of the proceeds will be going to its designer, Nezzy Monster, so be sure to pick this up before it's gone, because it's not coming back. Do you want a shirt? Maybe a mug or stickers? All of those will be available and more featuring this design. It will be leaving the Butter Store on November 1st, so act quickly, the link for the Teespring Store is in the description. Another announcement, which if you're keen and really pay attention to me when I post on the tab or on Twitter, you'll already have known about it, is the Year One Remaster. I've yet to start on it, but... 
it will be out before the end of the year. Essentially, what it is, is remaking and remastering old videos from the first year of the channel into one long special for you all to enjoy. New editing, maybe even new audio, will be present, so stay tuned for a release date on that as well. In regards to other content, I can't make any promises, but I will continue to experiment with other things on the channel. I've made about two stream shit posts videos, one of which was edited by my pal Weezer, though they didn't seem to perform too well. In fact, Weezer is working on something else very cool right now. He's working on a full-on remaster of the Halloween 2 part I did with Dumbsville last year. He's using our modern stills with some more grounded editing to make it a fun retold experience. In fact, it's going to be one video, not two. Some bad news, I suppose. The third year design is going to be taken down on November 1st, as well as any old designs featuring the old stills or from older videos. I know it's a bit of a bummer to take these down, but they don't necessarily match with the designs currently featured on the show. But instead, we will be bringing forth hopefully, some new designs featuring all of our characters. And Penguix's designs for the thumbnails will hopefully be made into some lovely merchandise for you all to enjoy. Other than those things related to the channel, I've been doing quite well in my private life. I've been attending my college classes and working on my novel with exceptional efficiency. The book will hopefully be published or by early next year, as it's almost complete. All that's left is editing once I finish the next two chapters. Once it's done, I will shill it here a lot, and if you don't buy it, I will cry. Also, I will be moving forward with some treatments regarding my gender transition. And the first up is definitely laser hair removal. If you want to help me transition faster or just want to help out the channel, please donate to my Patreon. It's listed in the description and you get some decent benefits with it, such as your name being featured and new benefits I'm adding soon. That new benefit will be video recommendations. I can't guarantee that your suggestions will be selected, but if they are, you'll get a snazzy little feature in the intro crediting you for your recommendation. If you'd like to support my transition directly, not through the Patreon, you can go to the GoFundMe that I also have linked in the description. That has helped immensely, and I really, really look forward to seeing the results after this long journey that I'm starting.